From playing schoolboy rugby to making his way through the ranks in the rugby game, Apelele Fasi wasted no time in claiming his spot in one of the best teams in South Africa, the Sharks. The 22-year-old established himself as one of the top upcoming rugby players of our country. So now, since we are in Durban, we decided to pay him a visit. Good morning. Good morning, Kush. How are you? Very well, thanks. How are you? Good, man. Right in time for my morning snack. Awesome. What are you having today? I'm just having a smoothie, so mm -hmm. I'll just show you what I'm kind of having. Um, just going to make a quick smoothie mm -hmm. for you today. I'm kind of having um, carrots, uh, spinach, a bowl of um, whey protein, mm -hmm. muesli here, and creatine. So hopefully, and some ice just to add a bit of variation in, in the water as mm -hmm. well. Spinach and carrots and some protein and things that I don't know. Am I going to get a six pack after this? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I, I hope so. I hope so. But before we get into making this, I want to know a little bit more about you. One thing I know is that you're from the Eastern Cape, the King Williamstown, and you moved to Durban, I believe, three years ago? Yeah, three years ago. Mm, and how has it been like living in Durban? It's been okay. Mm -hmm. um, three years now in Durban. It's wow. been fun. Um, obviously, I just met a, new, a lot of people mm -hmm. around me. Um, and yeah, I just love it here. The weather is so perfect. You, the winter here is like summer all day. I've heard very good things about Durban. The fact that it's sunny all year round. That's one thing that I love about it. Take us back in your rugby journey, starting at high school or primary school. Actually, where did your love start? So obviously I've got two brothers that obviously enjoyed a lot of rugby. Mm -hmm. um, I think my rugby started when I was back in um, primary school, probably grade six or something, mm -hmm. and playing with my brothers and everything. Then continued the journey, but never thought that I'll be, be standing here and I'll be where I am right now. Lockdown hit everyone across the board and yeah. things have been difficult. I can imagine for an athlete as well how frustrating it was. And how did you manage to get through that period? Oh, it's obviously been tough for everyone else. Um, for me, you know, I think family is the one thing that got me through this mentally. Mm -hmm. um, obviously the coaching staff as well, just being able to direct us and just give us information and uh, the programs that we need to stay fit. and. And just seeing our friends outside and just keeping in connection on, on your social media and everything, mm. I think that helped a lot. Awesome, man. Okay, I think I'm ready to get into the smoothie right now. So please show me the ropes. Okay, no, it's not a problem. <laughs> I'll get right into it. So how are you going to make the smoothie? So I basically put on um, muesli and a bit of water, my spinach and my carrots, um, four teaspoons or spoons of protein shake and one teaspoon of um, creatine and just add the ice at the end and just let it blend. Smoothie is done. Awesome! It looks very, very interesting before I actually drink it. To growth, success and securing bags. Definitely. Surprisingly very delicious. I love it. Definitely. Let's have a seat by the, by the way. Yes, please. Apelele, you had a fantastic season before lockdown in the Super Rugby. How much have you missed the game? Yeah, definitely. It's been like five months that we haven't played now. Um, really, really missed the game. And, you know, I obviously had dreams in this 2020 um, year. Um, dreams cut short but not denied. Mm -hmm. um, I guess um, since we're back to training now and, and hopefully we could Play, play again and mm. just be able to fulfill my dream. Mm. How is training different now in level two? Yeah, it's been different that we've been training in groups of fives and everything, you know, just missing the other boys and, and, and just fooling around and just um, mm. being able to create a, a bit of banter. But, you know, just, I'm just, we're just happy that we're all back in the park and just um, hopefully we could play again and yeah, mm. just enjoy each other's company. You're very young, you're 22 years old and you've achieved so much, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't stop here. Is the ultimate goal to play for the Springboks? Yeah, definitely. You know, coming from a family where a lot, a lot of people in my family played sport, uh, definitely rep representing my country will definitely be the ultimate dream that I want to, to achieve, you know. Mm -hmm. 
and when the opportunity comes or if it comes you know um, i'll grab it with both hands and just give praise to the lord awesome man yeah. is there any words of motivation for young people who want to be successful definitely put on the hard work you know enjoy what you're doing um don't do what you're doing just because you want you see other people do it or just you 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 must enjoy what you're doing um work hard be dedicated have a lot of discipline mm -hmm. you know um find a good support system and stick with that support system mm -hmm. for the longest time and obviously just seek advice as well from the people that are probably in the game and just yeah just get a lot of information and just totally work hard from apelele fasi himself love what you do continue working hard and remain persistent those are amazing words of encouragement thank you for welcoming us into your home it has been such an absolute pleasure hanging out with you yeah.